So this is our third full day here. It's Sunday today and I actually heard that the stores um, will close a bit more early. So we are heading to Superdrug because I heard that that's where you have to be if you want to buy some makeup and stuff. So that's what we're going to do. And we want to see the London Bridge today. What else babe? Oh, a lot of things. We're going to have sushi inshallah. And tonight we're gonna go eat at Balti. That's um, Bengali. a Bengali restaurant. So that's a lot of Indian food. Ninety-five percent of the restaurants here. Are yeah, Bengali. yeah. Ninety-five percent of the Indian restaurants are actually Bengali. So yeah, that's amazing. So let's go check out London again. London Bridge. I just love these buildings you guys. I'm just gonna show you. London Tower Bridge it's called I believe and it's over there I don't know if you can tell but it's actually closer by than it looks but yeah we're going there first we're gonna have to eat something because I'm getting kind of hungry so I'm just gonna eat a little half of a burrito, burrito right yeah while I was uh, shopping for makeup my husband was bored so he went to Chipotle he got a burrito I'm still gonna eat some of that and then we're gonna dig into the sushi. I'm so hungry, you guys. And then we're gonna walk over to the London Tower Bridge. So, you guys, I really think I would totally <coughs> love to move here, to live here in London, because I feel like this city just has so much to offer. And, um, yeah, I think I could. It's not like Langkawi, though, or Langkawi. I, I don't know how you pronounce it. That really felt like home. But this feels like a place where I could actually live and work, etc. So, who knows, who knows. We're not planning on moving to another country in the short term, but on the long term, I think we could. Yeah. I also met this amazing girl at TK Maxx. Her name was Zeynep. And um, it was just really nice to meet her. She was so sweet and so beautiful, mashallah. So that was really nice. I just love meeting people from all over the world. So I would love to have a friend in every city, in every country. So who knows, maybe one day. But yeah, that was really awesome as well. I feel like the people here are really kind. Um, at least that's my experience, that's our experience. So we feel really welcome. So that's nice. I'm so glad I finally got to see it. Can we walk over? Yeah, we're gonna go walk over it. So let's go. It's really, well, no, it's kind of crowded, but it's okay. It looks amazing, you guys. So I'm just gonna make a 
260. Don't get dizzy. checking out like local uh, supermarkets so right now we're in Sainsbury's local so we're just checking this out and we just ate so we're not really that hungry or anything which is good because when you go food shopping and you're hungry you end up with way more things than you actually need so we're just gonna get something to drink maybe and then head to the mosque so yes we have to get our prayer on and then we're gonna continue our day. I'm having so we're having so much fun, you guys. I oh, I love this city. No, in the dance. You guys, I love naked juice. Best oh, juice ever. So I just prayed. Alhamdulillah. There's actually a Muslim center here. That's something that we really need back home. Um, and there's a mosque and like for the men, and there's a whole different building for the women. So, like, <laughs> wow. You know, in Holland, sometimes you notice there's not even a mosque, like, not even a part for the women. Um, there's not even a place. And right here, you have a whole building. This is in East London, is what I think, I believe. <laughs> so, yeah. The, Muslim community here is just, I feel like it's different. Guys, my husband feels at home. <laughs> there are so many Bengalis here. And after dinner, we will come here, inshallah, if it's still open. Bangla town, but that's Pakistani. Um, I think I'm insulting people right now. I'm so sorry. So this is the starter dish and it's called Champuri. Champuri? Mm -hmm. And it's with chickpeas and some tomato sauce. So yeah, it looks amazing. And some mango lassi, of course. You guys, I got some curry, prawn curry with rice. I cannot eat anymore, you guys. I am so good. Alhamdulillah. I cannot even finish it, so I hope you can take it away. Because I don't want to waste it. And because this is our last night here, we decided like we're not gonna go to bed early We're just gonna go to the Arab street and see what's going on over there And after that we're gonna head back to the hotel, but for now we're gonna check out the Arab street. So let's go Oh, and by the way, it's kind of dark. So I think the, these parts like this part of the vlog The quality will not be that good, but I hope you guys don't mind Good morning. So today is our last day here. I'm so sad because we're having so much fun and we love London. So our flight leaves at 8.30. So we still have a big part, portion of the day to spend here. So that's really exciting. We want to go uh, check out Westminster Abbey. And um, I still want to go to a super drug again, I know. 
and that's kind of it. We don't really have any particular plans, right? Nope. nope. So we're just gonna chill. What? Go with the flow. Let's go with the flow. So we're just gonna chill out and enjoy our last day here in London. Best Abbey I've ever seen. Thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!